-hmm. not going to get down into the mud, slinging mud, you know, calling people's names and saying stuff, ugly things in a newspaper. I don't deal like that. Right now, Akron Schools Superintendent Dr. Michael Robinson is responding to claims that he's engaged in union busting, intimidation, and calling the Akron Education Association the devil. Just hours ago, Robinson spoke to Education Station reporter Danielle Wiggins. Danielle is here now with what he said. This is a big deal that you talked to him. Yes, it's been a contentious week here. And, Laura, my conversation with Superintendent uh, comes just days after the AEA rallied against Robinson before Monday's school board meeting. The union telling me that they wanted to support the educators who were losing their jobs or being reassigned as part of the district making $24 million in budget cuts to avoid an operating deficit. Now, those cuts were approved at Monday's school board meeting. AEA leadership claims Robinson has not been transparent through the process. They also took issue with comments Robinson made at a church Sunday where he said he was going to be crucified at Monday's board meeting and referenced a Bible verse about the devil. The union claims that Robinson said the administration building is his house and he's retaliating against people who speak out against him. I, I don't know where any of that stuff came from. Um, and, uh, you know, I go after teachers. No, I don't. I don't work in labor relations. And if a teacher or an employee of any sort does anything wrong, they deal with labor relations, not me. So the AEA union is also accusing Robinson of union busting, telling me Monday that Robinson plans to replace teachers who currently work in the district's central office with non-union employees. Robinson says he is not trying to dilute the union. In fact, he says he's pro-union. He tells me the plan is to disperse the work the teachers at central office are doing amongst the remaining employees. Now, he says the district will determine hiring needs in the future. And as I shared yesterday, those teachers uh, leaving the administration building due to the district cuts are either retiring, resigning, or going back into the classroom to teach. And coming up at five, you know, I'll tell you why Robinson, he says the district will really be in trouble if they don't pass a levy in the fall. And I know what everybody is asking, what is the dog doing behind him in the it side? It was a picture? It was a picture. It was his dog who passed away this past oh, January. So he's, he's, pretty much going through a lot right now. Yeah, and it, I think it is a big deal that you talk to him face to face to get his his words on this because there's a lot going on in Akron and obviously the goal here is to make sure the students are mm -hmm. educated and the teachers are happy and everybody's happy. So this is interesting. We look forward to more on this. All right. Danielle, thanks. No problem.